So when you say ITSM applications, what are the ITSM applications? Okay, they are incident management, okay, problem management, change management, okay, request management, and a few few other will come. Okay, knowledge reporting and all. They are also comes under ITSM only, but these are the main they will expect from us. Okay, minimum we have to tell at least this one and then later you can uh, learn one or two sp one special one and then try that also okay first point is that clear my everyone yeah yes sir yeah now second point is okay so how i can learn it see developer concepts we are learning it but general concepts like see incident management okay so i want to know about incident as a end user don't this particular learning when i say this particular learning it is not like a service node developer learning it's just like overall application learning okay as an end user as a normal person what is incident management what are the components in the incident management why incident management will be used when we use incident management what are the associated things are there okay these things how you will know okay so so far i don't know anything about it okay even i don't know what what is about incident also okay so how how i can learn incident management first of all see in order to implement incident management you should know about incident right what is incident right definitions of incident right you all agree yes or no yes. yeah now how i can learn incident how i want to if i want i want to learn incident management how i can learn incident okay you need a platform or a tool to do this first thing right okay so just look for incident management tools just see this is how we can learn ma it's not uh, this is not related to service now but general okay so these many incident management tools are there if you just go through here 10 best incident management tools Okay, maybe only incident management. It's not like IT has some full setup, but only incident management. Okay, you just install any one of these solar winds. Okay, maybe Remedy, Jira, these and all will come. Solar winds, and again, it came two times. Manage engine, yes, one. Okay, Spice Works. So you just take any one. Okay, in this 10, you take any one. Okay, so you have one tool. Let's say I don't know these tools also okay i can't because every everything if you download it now nah, it is uh, maybe one week free trial okay one month free trial okay i can't buy it right so you need a platform first of all you need a platform to practice it okay so which is the very easiest platform that you can get it service now go to developer.com create an account and it loads the entire setup without rupee one rupee also don't see service no course okay i'm not talking about service no course okay one application i am learning about one process okay so you just create an account you log into this one there you have incident management okay then you have already a pre setup okay this is good now i can learn from here first you you have a platform right till this point everyone agree yeah, now i don't know anything about incident right first read the documentation its itil incident management or demand management it is just like don't read a book but just to see what it is okay something like this and then the next easiest way is come here see the incident management create minimum 10 to 20 incidents Okay, create it and also see the existing incidents. Okay, when you are creating it, you will be creating, you will be filling every field. Okay, when you are seeing this field, when you are seeing this form, you will be knowing every option. What is color? Okay, so what is this one? What is this one? What is this one? So when you create minimum 10, you will understand why we are creating incident. And also before you are creating 10 incident, 20 incident, you know, the basic definition of incident management what is incident life cycle of incident okay 
incident how it will be identified i would it be created how it will be categorized prioritized this one maybe i will just give a basic idea okay you need to search for this kind of thing before you start creating many okay once you start creating it you will know what exactly it will be there in real time okay and if you see more incidents see here you have a repository here let's say open some 10 incident okay then it will tell you something why this incident is created they are reporting something how do you create a subfolder so the, this this one also there is something so it will take you to a company a team where you feel like okay this is my issue and if i get this kind of issue why i am re why how i can create it okay and why i kept all this impact and all and who it is like everything you will start seeing this thing category subcategory so this is how you will learn it you got it even service now also we are we are working we are uh, learning like this one we are seeing options we are trying options we are practicing options as a practice what you do is today okay first i am just starting with the practice only okay i will send you one small video it, it will be mo not more than five minutes okay I, I will search and send you okay just to watch it this is this why why this is for is this is to know the definition okay once you know the definition why we create instant management okay what is the purpose of instant management okay take a tool any tool okay which which have the instant management application okay ideally for our tool is service no tool come to here create minimum 10 incidents or create minimum five incidents okay this number will vary more. if you want to create 100 also you can create 100 the more you create the more knowledge you will get it and okay update five incidents what is the meaning of update five incidents more? create is fine you will just come and then create and then fill the data and then submit it this is what create but what is update five incident adding some other data to the incident and updating it on the right top corner of the so existing yes. yeah existing incident you can just open any few okay let's say take uh, this one go to open okay all these are active incidents so just open any okay and then update when you are updating means don't just say update just see okay it is in progress so work in progress or on hold or uh, resolved when you are changing it something also changing the dependencies and see these things okay when you have something called a service offering just click it and then see what you are getting nothing you are getting okay so observe it that's it you need to observe and this image you should get it in your mind when i say incident you should get this image okay let's see here here may be something like resolution notes is there now these two are mandatory okay why because the state is resolved or closed if i say in progress see the behavior they are none so there is a relationship between that state value to these two fields why when you are closing an incident you have to enter some data about why what is the resolution what you did to close that you fix that issue so these things and all you just start observing okay incident can be attached to a parent problem okay or a parent incident or a parent change okay so just to see this one so take this as a practice if you already knew incident management very well this practice can be skipped but if you are very new to this okay you have to do this one there is a purpose of doing it you will learn incident management okay and when you are doing it don't blindly do just read observe everything okay observe every time you hit new you will get a new number will be created caller okay when is a caller who is this caller okay for whom the issue got reported okay affected person the caller the meaning of caller is affected person so see these kind of things and read these kind of descriptions also just come here okay and just click this one 
okay where is description this is description right so get the description little like this and also get the short description little like this in the middle i mean to say middle okay no need to open each record okay so just get them and then see i want to know what is this incident i have i have to analyze all us data in fsca server system but i am unable to get to see the data so this is his issue it's a description and if you see a short description this one so now when let's say you took this you took this particular incident how you respond to this okay let's say i am belongs to one team i got this incident how i can respond so is there any attachment he given what error he given see here he's saying uh, uh, <coughs> but i am unable to get to see the data in west coast he said like this and he given the error also okay so if we see this is that related to this one to proceed so those kind of thing you start observe it i can say like my pen drive is not working or my application is not working okay every time it is giving error my application abc is not working so what error in order to solve from this group level what error it is reporting so they have to give proper if they don't give it the respective person keep it in on hold and say waiting for customer and say here one comment they will write please provide more details see here i am doing one ticket now so you are getting mandatory fields so without that ticket will not be saved see here consider like this data is not provided properly okay and i am the person who is handling the ticket okay this is i am this one okay i felt like this is not correct i i can't proceed with the provided data so what i do i keep it on hold on hold okay why i kept on hold is because of caller and then when i say this one i got one field here okay please provide more details and save it okay this too you don't get it my it will come in my instance only so you are getting what i am trying to say my everyone yes no yes yes no yeah Yes. So this is very important. Once you are hundred percent clear with instant management, no, you don't be learning hundred percent, but at least you will get some basic idea. Then we will also go through change. Okay. Once tomorrow when we come connect, okay, when everyone say I practiced it, then I will explain what is the what is instant management. Maybe just ten minutes. And what are the things we need to learn also from instant management? Okay. So this is learning the instant management. It is not related to service node developer concepts. Okay.